What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here and as you can see the Beast has went out and picked up Smash Brothers Wii U. My Wii U is now a powerful system. I am super happy about this. I played one game, a stock match of 10 that you guys are going to see and uh, I wanted to give you guys my impressions of the first game I played and how it felt. Now I'm going to say a few things, a few disclaimers. I did not use the GameCube controller. I actually used the Wii, uh, pa the Wii U pad uh, that comes with the Wii U, the big giant pad, uh, to see what it felt like. The reason I did that is because I actually did not get the dongle. Uh, the pre-orders, they had ran out of the dongle uh, down here at Georgia Tech, so I gotta go tomorrow morning and pick one up. So I came home, I, I tried it out, as you guys can see it looks great. <laughs> I mean, just the, the opening intro compared to stuff like Melee and Brawl. It looks fantastic, and uh, I'm super excited about this. I think my Wii U is probably going to be uh, getting more playtime than any console in the house now, and uh, I'm really excited about it. Hopefully, you guys are going to be picking this game up uh, so you can play with me, because believe it or not, I don't have any friends on the Wii U. Not one. You guys know I'm fairly new to the Wii U. I haven't picked up any friends to play online games with, and so I'm going to actually need you guys to join me. Uh, to play with me in this Smash Brothers uh, Wii U game. So uh, I'll have uh, my information on the screen briefly uh, to show you guys where you need to go, what you need to put in to add me as a friend. Now, uh, here we go. We got some Super Smash Brothers Wii U, man. I'm excited about this. All right, so you can see these are the people uh, down at Georgia Tech. I had to wait in the line. There was 1,200 people. 1,200 people down there picking up uh, this game and... Uh, picking up Pokemon so they're really excited about it here we go Smash Brothers Wii U what do I have to say about this it feels a lot like Brawl it feels a lot like Melee but it has the best parts of both now it moves like Melee uh, it's not quite as fast as Melee so far but then again I'm using the the Wii U pad so maybe I'm not you know tweaking it the same way I would on the GameCube controller but it feels very fast so for the people out there who um, didn't like the pace of Brawl, I don't think this game is going to be an issue at all. And uh, I'm playing as Mario. That is, uh, you know, my, my man in this game. That's that's the, the king. That's Don Corleone. And uh, that's what I do in this game. But it feels great. Graphically, I haven't seen all the stages. This is the only stage I've played on because this is my favorite map from Melee. And... Uh, Playing against some of these other characters is pretty cool. Sonic was trying to give me a little bit of trouble for a minute, but I got in there and smashed his ass. As you guys can see at the bottom of the screen, add me. That's my information. Zero Beastly Dash Gamer Zero uh, on on the Wii U, so we can get together and play some. Because I need I need you guys. I need you guys to make this thing fun. I actually uh, sent uh, some some friend invites out to some of the guys on the Beastly Thoughts crew. Hopefully they'll uh, they'll join up with me tonight. But man, that line, that line was ridiculous. It took at least an hour just to get my game. And by the time I got in there, they didn't even have any more of the dongles. And so I was a little frustrated about that. But uh, how did the, the Wii U controller feel? It felt okay. I mean, you can, you can play. You can actually get into a game and play if you know how to do it. If you play with the Wii U controller for maybe a few hours, you'll probably be as good as you can be on, on the uh, GameCube controller. I just don't like that that space in between the buttons. I don't like that giant screen in between my fingers. It feels like, you know, driving two cars at once. You know, you got one hand on one steering wheel and a hand on another steering wheel. And I like to have my hands a little bit closer, especially playing a game like Smash. But I was surprised at, uh, you know, the way it felt. It actually felt pretty decent. Um, if I had never played on a GameCube controller before, I probably would think that it felt okay, to be honest. So. For the people out there who are playing, you know, strictly on the Wii U controller, which probably aren't that many, I don't think it'll be that much of an issue, especially if you get some practice in. Um, I, I just wasn't able to do any wave dashing. <laughs> that was my issue. I just couldn't do it. Uh, and some of the, the jump button didn't feel the same uh, because of the, the way it's placed compared to the GameCube. So I'll be playing on the GameCube controller tomorrow. Super excited about getting in there with some of you guys. I will be actually uh, probably getting on tomorrow night after work. It's Friday, you know. You guys, just like you guys, I'm off on weekends, so uh, 
I'll be home tomorrow night, probably spend a few hours on this. And uh, Saturday, I'll be probably spending all day on it, and uh, hopefully most of the day Sunday. I want to dig in deep, see what this game has to offer. I've seen some of the new weapons. This shit is ridiculous. They've really gone haywire, uh, adding some crazy zany weapons in this game that drops. So I'm looking forward to seeing all of them. I've seen some crazy stuff, 8-bit stuff. I've seen... Uh, I'm, I'm not going to spoil it for the people who haven't seen it, but uh, there's some really cool weapons uh, that you can use that they've added into this game. Uh, so definitely be looking forward to that. There's going to be a lot of this game on my channel. There's going to be a lot on this uh, of this game on the Beast of Gamer channel. I can feel it now. It just feels right. And uh, God damn it, if you guys could have seen how many people were up there uh, waiting in line for this game tonight. Uh, it, I, as a gamer, I felt very proud uh, to be a part of that group of people, mostly college kids, but it was guys, girls of all ages out there just waiting to play a fucking awesome video game. That's one of the new weapons. <laughs> uh, you guys remember that from the old school Mario game. Uh, it was actually really cool, but to be out there with those people and, and feel that love and hear all these people screaming and yelling uh, to get their hands on Smash Brothers and Pokemon, because there are a lot of people out there for the new Pokemon game as well, just made me feel, you know, awesome. And, and I think the future of gamers is in good hands because we've got so many passionate young people out there uh, looking to play the next new thing. And I'm actually really excited to see what happens with Nintendo at this point. Uh, just based on what I saw tonight at one GameStop at a midnight release, Nintendo is going to kick some major ass uh, over the next couple of uh, days, weeks, and months because of this game. So I'm just kind of eager to see exactly what they're going to be able to pull out of their hat as far as sales, as far as moving consoles, because I think that uh, probably more so than any other Nintendo game that has been released, Smash Brothers probably has the power to get people to buy consoles. So I'm going to be watching that closely. I'll let you guys know what I find. Well, I'm going to fade to the back and let you guys enjoy the rest of this footage. I hope you guys enjoy this. This is Smash Brothers for the Nintendo Wii U, and of course, I am using the Wii U controller <laughs> until tomorrow. As always, if you guys enjoyed this game, please, please hit that thumbs up button and show some support. You might not know it, but it really does mean a lot for the channel. Also, if you're new to the channel, consider hitting that subscribe button. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank <laughs> you.